Time to add router 3 to the mix, and routers 2 and 3 are going to be communicating over the 172.23.0/24 network. Router 3 is not on the serial network in this lab. So let's go ahead. I did do a couple of tests here before we started just to make sure everything was still in place, and it is. You can see router 2 still associated with 123.1. It's still getting its time from that device, so we're set there. The two devices can ping, and just out of habit, I ran show NTP associations on router 3, even though router 3 isn't running NTP yet. So let's go ahead and run show clock while we're at it. And you can see that router 3 isn't quite as behind the times as router 2 was earlier, but still we need to get that synced up and get router 3 up to date. We're going to set up a peering here just for fun instead of setting up another server-client relationship. And we'll start on 2. Nothing tricky here with the command. And let me let that catch up with me here. Thanks. I know it's an incomplete command. There we go. And we're going to put 172.12.23.3 there. That's all there is to it. You can do a prefer on peerings as well if you want to. But for our purposes, this is the only thing we really need. And we just put the peering commands on there, and you're all set. And now, as a great man once said, now we play the waiting game. Because that's exactly what we're going to do. And I will bring you back as soon as the association has finished syncing up. And we're looking good. We've got show NTP status now. Clock is synchronized. That is the key. It's what we're always looking for. Notice now that we're at stratum 10, which is one down from stratum 9, which is where we're getting our time from. And there's the reference, and now the reference point being the device we're getting at the time from, 172.12.23.2. And everything looks good. Let's run show NTP association. See what we see there, and we've got 23.2 for the address, the associated device. We see where the associated device is getting its time from which is 123.1, the associated device is a stratum 9, and we just don't care about this stuff yet in our studies. So we are all set there. We'll run a quick show clock because that's what it's all about, and we see that the time has synced up. So I've got one more option I want to show you with NTP. Coming up next, we're going to look at broadcast mode for just a few minutes, and then we'll move on to NAT and PAT. I'll see you there.